Now that we've got the push button figured out, we're going to add a temperature sensor, a TMP36. The TMP36 has three leads for power, signal, and ground, and we'll plug it into three separate slots in the breadboard. Connecting ground to the top lead and power to the bottom lead, we should be able to read the signal from the center lead. Plug the meter into ground and try reading the power supply, and it's not there. I really need to remember to put a wire across from the one ground side to the other. So now I've got a signal of 0.74 volts corresponding to a temperature of about 24 degrees and if I put my finger on it the voltage goes up as the temperature goes up. So now I'm going to move it up to the top of the board. I'm going to put the power and ground leads directly into the power and ground rails and I'll put the output lead into that empty slot right in between the two contacts on the button. That'll get things nice and compact. I should have remembered to power the red side too. Now I can see the temperature output rising with my finger and then falling again as I let it cool. So now I have the temperature sensor working. All that's left to add is the photocell.